Good afternoon, LaSalle Catholic, or good morning or good night, whatever time of day you're listening to this Principally Speaking video update. Number two of the year. Hopefully you're liking this version. I'll be a lot quicker than last week here. What I wanted to speak to, um, as promised last week, um, we're going to speak more uh, frequently through our communications about our four great things and our profile of a graduate. Uh, the first thing we say about a graduate from LaSalle Catholic is that she or he is faithful. And of our four great things, we say that we focus on Jesus. He's the really the reason for this school. And I hope that you're experiencing that, that your kids experience that. That seems uh, to be authentic about what we do, um, that we recognize that's the reason for what we do. Kind of at the... Um, the forefront of everything that we're about here. So um, I wanted to speak to a couple of specific things. One, with our, our some of our youngest kids, we have a new atrium for the Catechesis of the Good Shepherd. You're going to hear us talk more about it as we go because it is so fantastic that we have it. Uh, it's so good for our kids. If you hear the volunteers who are working there or if you hear the um, kindergarten teachers who are in there or if you go see the space, it's very apparent that it's, it's set aside as something very, very special. Having said that, we do integrate our faith throughout everything we do. If you listen to this week's podcast, you'll hear uh, Mrs. Sterling, our middle school counselor, talk about how we pray all the time. <laughs> we pray. She said she's been in other Catholic schools. She's worked uh, in other Catholic schools, but we pray a lot here because we know it's important. Uh, as I'm recording this, there's adoration happening in our chapel. Um, then, too, I wanted to speak just briefly about uh, two other pieces. Here in the middle school, We um, I overheard at lunch some of our sixth graders talking about how excited they were to go on their splurge retreat. Our fifth graders just went on a renewal yesterday, and several eighth graders helped facilitate that. Um, then we also are hoping to rekindle our, our faith-sharing groups that met every afternoon last year. And then also um, Mrs. Uh, Ms. Kilberg is looking at um, some new service opportunities that we can do through Lancer Hour. So just kind of always building on this piece, growing in faith as individuals. Individuals, um, and as a school and then finally I'll just say the staff here the people who work with your kids day in and day out just a really committed faithful group of humans so the, that first piece of both our profile of a graduate and our four great things um, just a couple of pieces of proof in the pudding so to speak about what we do and a reason that I'm so excited to be here and I hope that those are uh, you know reasons that you're excited to be here as well thanks God bless